Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and uh, this is a quick video for those of you that have a Intel graphics adapter in your computer. In the last week, Intel made something that is, I believe, a very good move. It actually has enabled the download of Intel drivers that will override whatever driver your manufacturer of hardware wants you to have. One of the reasons is mainly that a lot of manufacturers stop updating at a, a certain point, but Intel still continues to update and will have newer drivers. Also, a lot of uh, laptops, a lot of computers sometimes have little glitches here and there. And we know that, you know, the OEM or the original manufacturer drivers, sometimes they're to blame for problems we have. So uh, there is now... In this page, I will share this page, the downloads for graphic drivers. So the beauty of this is that if you don't know what to download, the first thing that you see here is automatically update your drivers and it has a get started button. This will have you download a tool that once you actually execute it, will verify your hardware and download the proper uh, driver that you need for your hardware. So that's the uh, easiest part. It takes a little while, but apparently it's not that difficult to do. Then if you know what you're doing a little more, you can actually go and below it, you see all the different drivers that you can download so you can check out what you want. The first one at the top here, the uh, Intel Graphics Windows 10 DCH drivers, that's the uh, drivers that actually will override your OEM, your original manufacturing drivers for your device. So for example, I have an Intel um, graphics chip. And when I look here in the device manager, you can check out if you do have a graphics chip that from Intel by right clicking the start menu, going into device manager and here expand the display adapters. I've got an Intel UHD graphics 630. In my case, the driver I have is from May the 28th, 2019. We are May of 2020. So there are new drivers and I will actually execute this, download this one for me. But like I said, if you don't know exactly what to download, just click the automatically update your drivers with the get started button, follow the instructions and here you'll be pointed in the right direction by the assistant that Intel also has for your PC. So this is good news. Uh, I've heard of several people that had little glitches here and there, including on their Surface laptops, and that downloaded the drivers from here, and it actually fixed some of the problems they had with the display. So I think it's a good thing to probably download and override your manufacturer's drivers, unless it really goes very well and everything is okay, because it's not something you have to do. But if you have Intel graphics, got some little weird display glitches, maybe you uh, could take a look at the graphics drivers available here. So the link to this web page is in the description below the video. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.